we down here at the place, y'all. Cleaning up these trails. They done start limbs and trees and start growing out in the road. So we had to come through here and clear the road up. So that way you drive through here, you won't scratch a uh, scratch a truck all up. I got my son with me today. Came down here last weekend and filled my feet up, and it it was so heavy. One of the legs sunk down in the ground, so. The feet are leaning, so we're gonna see if we can fix it uh, today. Hopefully, it's still standing. It was leaning last week. I'm just not able to get back down here, so hopefully, it's still standing up. Because I put like 700 pounds in it. Yeah, it's still standing, but it's leaning though, so that's a good thing. Yep, leaning. The one in the back sunk down in the ground, so get up in and see if we can fix it right quick. It ain't that bad, so we might be able to fix it. Glad it didn't it didn't fall all the way down. That wasn't it. What? That must that must have just happened. With the dirt. Yeah. Wobbling, wobbling up in there. They still been eating it. I'm just glad the hog thing ain't done tore it all tore it all the way up. Alright y'all, so this is what happened right here. It's leaning. There's one leg on the back on the back side over here. Sunk down in the ground. So I don't know how I did that because I had I had something in it. Uh I had a piece of uh iron behind it the last time, so I don't know why it sunk down in the ground, but we're finna see if we can raise it back up, so y'all stay tuned. But what the, boy, what's that you got on your head, boy? Let me the new show, merch, hey, man. Show them, show them people what you got on your head, man. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about, boy. New merch. Hey, we hey, we got hey, we got that new merch, man. Hey, check your boy out. Hey, better get you one, man. Limited edition. Get you one. That's what I'm talking about. Let us get started, man. Who did my girl say? I know you ain't out there with, with no side on, but I know you got something on you close by, don't you? Yeah, I always keep something close by. I ain't never out here empty handed. I ain't bring my grundle. I came down here to work, so I left my grundle at home. All right, so, huh? Probably want to find something. Stick something up under there. I hate the damn hogs. See, this is what the hogs. This is what the hogs do to your stuff, man. They just mess your feet up and they wall around and dig around up under your feet, and then when it rain, it just make a slop hole up under your feet. You 
know what? Get them gloves for me. They up on the up on the back seat. Get it up, then I probably can hold it. Then I should be able to hold it. That way, you can slip the six down. We forgot the shovel at home, so we had we got we trying to improvise. Shallow, it's shallow down there. Once we put that board down there, it'll be all right. Let's see if we can push this one. Through. Wait for it. Hey, it's on the board. It's on the board? Yeah. Oh, Let's go. It's gonna stay. It'll stay. Let's go. Yeah. Woo! Boy, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, man. Hey. That feed got 700 pounds in it. We had to pull it up out the ground. These poles, these poles about, about 20 feet long. So he, it was in the ground. It's about right there, yeah. It was in the ground, shit, about damn near eight feet in the ground. So we pulled it up. Right now we got it resting on this four by four. So we're gonna leave that four by four in the ground and uh, just pack it down, pack it back down. And uh, it should be good to go. But if you see this old clay dirt, it's so soft. Then they got a lot of marsh in it because this little stream over here keep the ground set, keep the ground saturated. So it stay, it stay soft back here all the time. But we got it. But they've been eating, so we got. We got deer tracks. Got hog tracks. Got wreck. Got coons. Uh oh. What was that? Oh, it slipped. It's still holding. Probably have to put it diagonal under it. Yeah, kind of tilted a little bit. Yeah, we'll fix it. 
But we got it back up, folks. It's so it's straight. So right now we're going to... We're going to tilt that... Tilt that log. Kind of where that leg or wrist on it. Or kind of wrist on it. And uh, pack it back down then. It'll be good to go. Well, let me take this... Let me take this merch off, man. Let me take this merch off, man, cause I don't want to get it. I don't want to get it, get it dirty. Bam. I guess I'ma uh, we're gonna raise back up on it, and I'ma hold it, and you try to tilt that board, try to lean that lean that board in, it like this. Just push it back. Oh, uh, if you, you know what? Oh, uh, what you can do is just start digging. Just start digging on the back side of it, and then it'll start leaning. But I hold it. It's gonna slide off. Straighten it. Straighten it back up. That's good. That's good. I just start digging it out on the back on the back side. It'll it'll start leaning. Hmm. Let me see. That's the leg, that's what it was supposed to be on. This is what it's supposed to be on right here. Put the inside of the circle on the edge of this. What you mean? You know, you know how I got the gap in the circle? Mm -hmm. Put it on this, like, let the circle go around it. Oh, oh shit. shit. That should hold it right there. See, it's lean, you know? Yeah. The knee heel over here, though. The knee to come over soon. Let me see if I can get it out here. Alright, uh. Help me raise it up. Then I'm going to hold it. You pull that block out. And then tilt that iron piece. Tilt that iron piece up under that leg. <clears throat> tilt. I got it. I got this. That's it. That's it. Nah. Whew. Ain't going nowhere now. Ain't going nowhere now. So what we did, people, I did find a, I did find a piece of iron that I had down in that hole. Some kind of reason it, the pole had done slipped off of it, but that's a piece of old frame. And uh, I got it, we got it tilted up under that leg, so that leg won't be able to sink in the ground no more. Cause it's resting on that frame, so all we gotta do now is just cover it back up because it ain't going nowhere. But we got it back straight, so that's all that matter. Y'all stay tuned, we're gonna cover this hole back up. And that's gonna be it. We're gonna get up out of here. That's all we came. That's all we came down here to do. Straighten this here back up, fix this leg. We got that iron up under there. We're going to cover this hole back up. Then we're going to get out of here. Y'all stay tuned. CMB Outdoor. I'm just glad it didn't. I'm just glad it didn't tear the feet all the way up. Would have went some more with her.
I know. All right, people. We got it fixed. And uh, we're going to get up out of here. We got one more feeder we're going to check on. It's probably empty. So we're going to go down there and check on it. And if it's empty, we're going to put some more corn in it. But y'all can see it still got, still got corn and protein in there. But everything good, man. Everything's still functional. We just got this walla hole down here. I usually bring my shovel and dig it out, but the next time I come down here, I'm gonna bring some some concrete bags and I'm gonna post some concrete down here. Maybe that'll keep them hogs from making a walla hole up under the feeder. But everything good now, nah, man. We straightened it out. And uh, we're going to get on to the next one, man. Y'all stay tuned. See and be all do. Bam. Anything in? Anything in? Still got farm in there. Got a goddamn squirrels and look how they just eating them, eating them kernels up. Them ain't nothing but squirrels. They just eat the kernel, kernel out the middle. So them ain't nothing but squirrels. Got some deer tracks. I ain't turned my camera back on yet. So what we did was we set up a we set up a a little seat up in this cedar right here. Because we was gonna make a for a bow. We was gonna have a spot for a crossbow. Or either either a uh, traditional bow, and that ain't number what? What did it about a twenty yard? That's about a twenty yard shot from here to up there. So this year we probably have a crossbow this year. So we'll climb up in that little cedar tree right there, and we'll wait on them hogs to come out. That's it, man. We're going to put this corn in here so we can get on up out of here. We ain't come down here to stay. You uh, probably just got to take the ladder out of here. You can reach it. You ain't going to be able to reach over there and reach that. Oh, go for it. Show feel good when you got a little help with you. I ain't got to do all the work by myself. <laughs> Oh, 
it's about right here to this line. I usually uh, keep this lane cut. So probably in the next couple of weeks, I'm gonna bring the tractor down here and I'm gonna cut this uh, lane right here. CNB hog hunts coming soon. There you go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Just so, uh, huh? Caterpillar. <laughs> Fold them bags up and we're gonna get up out of here. All right, people, that's that's all we came down here to do, man. So we fixed that one feeder that was leaning, put some corn in this other feeder on this lane behind the house. And that's all we came down here to do, man. We're gonna head on back to head on back to Houston. And uh we didn't come down here to waste no time. We came down here to take care of business and get up out of here. So that's it, man. Appreciate y'all watching. CNB Outdoors, boss man. Peace. I'm about to do some. I'm about to do some about this. It's a lot of water come through here. Well, it really ain't got no drainage down here, so a lot of water come through here and it clog up my my cover here on this end right here because this it runs downhill. Coming from down there, it run down here. So when it get right here, everything clogs up right here. And when it clog up right here, it make the water run down, run down through my property and it's washing my, washing my property out. Washing my property out right there. So I'm gonna have to figure out how I'm gonna keep this, this drainage right here from uh, clogged up, but it's just right there. So they put my meter in. That's the latest update. And uh, my son done got all these leaves out the drain right here. They weren't supposed to put my meter right here. They were supposed to put my meter down there. I'm sure y'all where I wanted, where they were supposed to put the meter at. This is where I wanted the meat at down here. I wanted the meat right here and run straight straight through there. But they put it down there. So But I'll make it work. It's too late now. But I'm gonna call them and let them know they put it in the wrong place. Let me see what's going on in here. Look like they got it locked. Oh, no, it ain't. It don't look like he got no time on it or nothing. Oh, there you go. It got a lid. <clears throat> it got a lid on it. So it's all digital. But that's it, y'all. But that's it, y'all. Dug on my meter. Got my water set up. So I just came down here to check on everything. That's the latest update. But that's it, people. Just came down here to check on the place. They done put the water meter in. So that's the first step. 
So now they uh, think they're doing the permits and stuff for the foundation and everything. And uh, that's it. After that, they supposed to get started. Once they uh, they supposed to do the uh, the blueprint for the foundation, then after that, they're going to get started. But they got the water meter in. So that's the latest update. So y'all stay tuned, man. It's coming. CNB, I'll do it. Boss, man. Peace.